Hi primary one, how are you today? I hope all of you are feeling well and happy today. Um, so before we start our religious education, Christianity today, of course we need to pray first, right, friends? Okay. Uh, so this time. You can pray by speaking inside your heart. Yeah. So today, Miss Leo will not lead the prayer. You can ask your parents or your other family members to pray with you. Yeah. Okay. So let's close our eyes. If you are a Catholic, you may start by making the sign of cross. If you're a Christian, you can just put your hands together like this. Okay. So if you are ready, we are going to pray. You can say the prayer from inside your heart. Miss Leah will also pray from inside my heart. Let's pray, friend. Amin. Okay, thank you, friends, for for doing the prayer. Terima kasih teman-teman sudah berdoa. Nah, hari ini kita mau cerita tentang apa ya? Do you know what are we going to discuss today? Hmm, well. Before that, I am curious, friend. Miss Leah is curious. Uh, when you pray before, what is it in your prayer? Jadi, waktu teman-teman berdoa tadi, apa sih yang teman-teman doakan? Um, did you say thank you to our God? Did you say thank you to Jesus? Or did you say your gratefulness for something? Or did you ask for something to our God? Or what, friends? What is it? If you are asking something, what is it that you ask? Jadi teman-teman, waktu teman-teman berdoa, Apakah teman-teman mengucap syukur juga? Atau teman-teman meminta sesuatu saja? Terus kira-kira apa yang teman-teman minta ya? Waktu kita berdoa, kita kira-kira lebih baik hanya meminta saja atau dengan bersyukur juga ya? So when we pray, Uh, is it better to only ask for something or should we also remember to be grateful, to say thank you? And also friends, uh, when you pray, did you pray for someone? Did you pray for yourself? Or did you also pray for someone else? Maybe your family, your friends, or anyone. Waktu teman-teman berdoa, apa teman-teman berdoa untuk diri sendiri? Atau juga mendoakan teman-teman, keluarga, orang lain? Oke, okay. how is it? Oke, okay. by the way, today... We are going to talk about praying. Kita mau bicara tentang berdoa. Kenapa ya kita harus berdoa? So, from today's uh, Bible verse, it is from Romans chapter 12, verse 12. Atau Roma 12, ayat 12. If you have your Holy Bible with you, 
you can try to open it and read the verse. Or we can just read it together. Jadi teman-teman boleh buka Alkitab teman-teman untuk membaca ayat ini. Atau boleh juga kita baca bersama-sama. Oke, okay. so let's read it together friends. Be joyful in hope, patience in affliction, faithful in prayer. Be joyful in hope, patience in affliction, faithful in prayer. Sekarang kita ulang bahasa Indonesia ini, oke? Okay? Bersukacitalah dalam pengharapan, sabarlah dalam kesesakan, bertekunlah dalam doa. Sekali lagi ya. Bersukacitalah dalam pengharapan, sabarlah dalam kesesakan, bertekunlah dalam doa. Good job, friends. Oke. Okay. Jadi di sini ada kata bersuka cita dalam pengharapan, sabar dalam kesesakan, dan bertekunlah dalam doa. Jadi harus tekun berdoa begitu? Hmm, kenapa ya? So, friends. Well, When you are, uh, when you pray before, is it the first time you pray today? Waktu kita berdoa bersama-sama tadi, hmm, apakah itu pertama kalinya teman-teman berdoa di hari ini? So actually, when should we pray? Sebenarnya kapan sih kita perlu berdoa? Well, uh, should we pray in the morning, in the afternoon, in the evening, or when was it? Actually, uh, usually we pray when In like the boys, he is praying before he eat. Yeah, he prays before he eat. So friends, do you remember to pray before you eat? Do you remember to say thank you to our God, to Jesus, because he has given us the delicious food for today? Do you remember to say thank you to God before you eat? Hmm. I hope you remember. And also before you go to bed, sebelum teman-teman pergi tidur, teman-teman sudah ingat berdoa belum ya? Have you remember to pray before you go to bed? To say thank you because you because you have a great day because you have a safe day. Jadi sebelum tidur teman-teman sudah berdoa belum? Mengucap syukur karena hari yang menyenangkan, karena hari yang lancar dan baik. And how about in the morning? Did you pray? Do you pray when you wake up in the morning? Waktu teman-teman bangun tidur di pagi hari, apakah teman-teman ingat berdoa? Hmm. Or do you forget? Atau teman-teman lupa? Hmm. So if you remember to pray when you wake up, so what did you pray? Kalau teman-teman ingat berdoa di pagi hari, apa yang teman-teman doakan? Mengucap syukur untuk tidur semalam? Atau apa? Tell me about it, friends. Well, actually, uh, other than before eating, 
before going to bed or in the morning when we wake up uh, when should we pray mm, can we pray before we study is it good to pray before we study oh yeah like before the play date jadi kalau berdoa sebelum belajar itu bisa nggak ya perlu nggak ya Or when you want to go somewhere, do you think you need to pray? Sebelum pergi ke suatu tempat, perlu berdoa enggak ya? Or maybe when you are happy and sad, would you pray, friend? Waktu teman-teman gembira atau teman-teman lagi sedih, teman-teman berdoa enggak? So... Actually, when should we pray? Hmm. All the time? Or when is it? Okay, have you remembered to pray uh, all the time, friends? Teman-teman sudah ingat untuk selalu berdoa? Okay. Then, if you want to pray, uh, what is the best? Place to pray, friend. Kemana kita harus pergi kalau mau berdoa ya? Um, do you need to pray in the bathroom? Yes, if you want, you can pray in the bathroom. If you think you can, you feel comfortable there. Or in the park. Do you want to pray in the park like the girl here? Well, I think praying can be anywhere. But when you want to pray, um, do you think we can go to a noisy place? Or should we find a quiet place? So what kind of place will make you comfortable to pray? Tempat seperti apa yang teman-teman nyaman untuk berdoa. Oke. Okay. So, friends. I have something to ask to you. Hmm, I mean, I have something uh, for you to do. So, friends. Uh, I want you to pray together with your family. And you lead the prayer. Jadi Miss Leo mau minta tolong kepada teman-teman untuk memimpin doa, untuk berdoa bersama-sama dengan keluarga. So you can do it in the morning. You can pray with your family in the morning. Or at night before you sleep. Or anytime. Jadi teman-teman boleh berdoa uh, di pagi hari, boleh di malam hari. Boleh kapan saja bersama keluarga. But I need your help to lead the prayer. Miss Lia mau minta tolong teman-teman untuk pimpin doa. Oke? Okay? Oke. Okay. And after that, uh, you don't need to send video, friends. But uh, you can ask. Uh, but later Miss Lia will ask your mom or your dad to... Share about how do you pray. Jadi nanti Miss Lia akan tanya ke mama atau papa. Gimana teman-teman berdoanya? Gitu. Jadi uh, nanti Miss Lia akan dengar dari mama atau papa. Gimana teman-teman berdoanya? Oke. Okay? So uh, moms and dad. Uh, after the kids pray. Please uh, help to observe how do they pray. Okay. So, and then last one, primary one. After you pray, yeah, it can be with your family or when you pray alone. Please tell me how do you feel after you pray. Gimana perasaan teman-teman setelah teman-teman selesai berdoa. Okay. Okay. 
Thank you, friends, for doing our RE today. I hope you enjoy your day and don't forget to pray. Okay? Thank you, friends. See you next time.